you know, you know, you know, Mr. Daniel. And uh, speaking, speaking of the women, yes, uh, before the marriage, when I was a young man, yes, it, I, I dated uh, Catherine the New and Gucci Bado at the same time. <laughs> yes, you understand this? Ten Maya, you, you speak French, yes, you understand this? Un, deux, trois, we could go. You cannot understand, yes, you cannot understand. Yes, so, so the real reason I am here today, uh, other than to do this crazy French accent, c'est fou, yes, uh, crazy, uh, yeah, is because to announce uh, the top five reasons that we have at Paris Saint-Denis, okay? <laughs> <laughs> this is, yes, top five reasons. Reason song, okay? Reason song, <laughs> ten miles French, yes? <laughs> More than that, right? Okay. Reason cat, mix with love. Cat, where well, are you? Cat is me. Cat. Okay, reason cat is that uh, in 1966, uh, Bob Assis and Axel Bombs, they needed a place to drink on the Champs Elysees. <laughs> so they had an office there. Okay. okay. So true. Uh, I, I may forget the other results, such as late in the evening. Uh, reason trois, trois. <laughs> mix with love. Reason trois is that. Uh, uh, oh, yes, I remember we said, oh, Candice, how are you? Yes. Uh, Candice needs a place to put her shopping bags. Reason, reason, what? Reason, do? Do? Uh, am I saying that right next to a love? You are French? No, no, you're not. <laughs> reason, do is that uh, we needed a place. We have a partner named Marc Olivier. <laughs> that name is so French. <laughs> it's so French. We needed a place to make him managing partner, so we recreated the Paris of Mark Olivier. By the way, he is not French, I don't think. He's American, but anyway, Olivier is a very French name. Okay. And the number one, un, or is it un? Yeah. The number one reason why we have the Paris office is to balance the fact that we have an office in Jersey City. What is Jersey City? Uh, Tony Soprano lives there, something like that. Okay, uh, yes, thank you very much. All right. Well. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. You know, this is the point in the evening where one of the women in the audience is supposed to say, Rob, you know, you really look better without hair. <laughs> <laughs> but nobody's, nobody's... You know, really look better without hair, Rob. Uh, thank you, thank you. And so, um... So just a couple, a couple more things, because we're running a little bit late. So the reason that I came out this way is because Aviva were it. You can thank Aviva. Aviva called me after last year and said, you know, Rob, you know, I got it. You know, I'm hip that you came out as Pharrell Williams, but 95% of the partner had no idea why you came out with the hat and the track jacket, right? So she said, you have to do something more current. So I thought, <laughs> <laughs> so I thought okay, okay. What I'll do is I'll come out as a... Operation Bruce Jenner. <laughs> right? uh, okay. All right. Uh, well, it's not bad. Come on. And so one more thing. So the good thing about the wig, the wig is really versatile. Okay, it's really versatile because if I put my normal glasses on, right, all of a sudden I'm John Lennon. Right? <laughs> you know, it, it, it's kind, of, it's kind of an interesting. It's a good look for me. Yeah. So, so it's a. I wasn't talking about Jesus as a person or God as a thing, you know? Give me some chance, Paul. So, all right, that wouldn't be so well. All right, so, but one, one thing I learned in preparing, you know, people give up other people in the audience. Do you remember last year when I was the host? Pretty good, these two, they're still my friend. Last year when I was the host, people would come up to me and say things about other people in the audience. And last year, you might remember, Gary Simon was exposed to someone who had never given a partner speech, and I forced Gary to do so. And can you believe it or not, some other idiot tonight was bragging to the rest of his table <laughs> that he's never given a partner speech. Impossible! Who could that be? Impossible! Sensational! Who could that be? Tell me who that is! And it's Ted Meyer! 